Imagine. Trousers that will stand up for you, change shape at the touch of a button, even take themselves off without lifting a finger. So we're aiming for about 10, 15 percent okay. extra boost in power. They call them the right trousers. Over that threshold from not being able to get out of your chair yeah. to being able to get out and go and make a cup of tea. Inspired by Wallace and Gromit, who invent a robotic pair that are hijacked by a penguin up to no good. These are strictly for humans to give an extra boost, and yes, they'll come in different colours. Our goal really is to replicate the biological muscles in clothing. There are about six million people in the UK who need mobility assistance. And one class of people are those who are living at home independently and they're very happy to live at home. But then their mobility reduces slowly over time. Cheryl's helping test the technology. Cerebral palsy means she can't stand up for long. But clothing that does some of the work for her, well, that would be welcome. It makes such a difference for, you know, people who are elderly, people with disabilities. You know, it's, it's so wide ranging. I think sometimes you see things and they're so specialist and you think, but that's only going to apply to such a limited number of people that this project really seems like it could appeal to the masses. And it looks quite organic. And, it looks and that could be the future. Scientists in Bristol believe one day we might all be wearing clothing with extra biceps built in. All of us really sometimes need that little bit of boost, a little bit of assistance. So we expect that in future these devices will move from a healthcare setting into a consumer setting. Could you make these so small that they're sort of in invisible in a piece of clothing, for example? Absolutely. These, will, these and the other technologies that we're developing are going to be smaller, thinner, lighter. The idea is to refine these artificial muscles and hide them in clothing, eventually perhaps becoming part of everyone's everyday wardrobe. Well, yeah designed Very with cool. those who need okay. more help in mind. Oh, my knees. <laughs> which actually is everyone as we get older. Andrew Plant, BBC Points West in Bristol.